Eyewitness Sports. It's been a while since we said that. The Colts' uh, four-game losing streak is finally over, and what a great attack by this team. Andrew Luck with four touchdown passes, the defense with five turnovers, and the running game was awesome, too. Here's all the highlights. Second quarter, Andrew Luck starts heating up. He fires a bullet to Eric Swoop, 17-yard TD, 6-0 lead. Next possession, Luck finds Marlon Mack. He's wide open. He takes the pass, burns down the sideline, 29 yards for six more. The Colts up, 14 zip. Here come the Colts again. Luck rolls out and threads the needle to T.Y. Hilton. Great catch, 21-0 lead. Colts defense with two takeaways in the first half. Here's Mike Mitchell, just joined the team a couple of weeks ago. He comes up with a pick, 47-yard return. Adam Vinatieri did the rest. The Colts up 24 zip at halftime. Second half, the defense turns up the heat. Three more turnovers. They were making it happen. Luck finishes with four touchdown passes as he hits T.Y. Hilton for this sweet play. And how about the running game? Marlon Mack with 126 yards and a touchdown as the Colts roll on 37 to 5. And Bob Kravitz from WTHR.com joins me now. We've been on the road with this team, watching them suffer through this losing streak. It's good, great for everybody to see them get a win. Yeah, I mean, they played a perfect game, virtually perfect game, against a vastly imperfect team. Buffalo is a team you really should beat and beat handily without their quarterback. And then LaShawn McCoy, their running back, goes out early. So they did what they had to do, and they showed you what the kind of team they can be when they don't turn the ball over. They didn't turn the ball over, had one safety. And this was interesting, watching the running game. The Colts with 220 rushing yards. I, it's been a long time since they pounded the ball like this. It was great to see. It was unbelievable. And I, I, I'm hard-pressed to ever remember a game during Andrew Luck's tenure where they ran for more yards than they passed for. And it just takes so much pressure off him. He had the four touchdown passes. He was very efficient, played really, really well. But the running game, that was the revelation. And the defense with five turnovers. It was an impressive performance by this defense. It seems to be growing again. Absolutely. And I think Mike Mitchell has made a big difference. Yeah. This is a guy who is working out you know, on his own down in Miami. He gets the call, and he's making a lot less money than he's used to making. But he's come out here, and he's been a good player and a leader for this young team. All right, so the Colts now 2-5. and five, So they're still relevant, at least in town here. I mean, people are going to talk about them again. Absolutely. And look, nobody's running away with the AFC South. And the Colts do have a lot of home games coming up after the, the trip to Oakland. So I guess all things are still possible. All right, you can read much more. Bob Kravitz, WTHR.com. I'm Dave Calabro. Great news. Colts win. Talk to you later. A lot of excitement for sure. Dave and Bob, thank you.